Well, you know what? Not here. Yeah. It's always a good time. It is a good time. And we are talking about ahi tuna. Now, that's a ahi. big, big fame favorite for a lot Absolutely. of people. Absolutely. We've got yep. Chef Sean with us, Sean Bajan. He's the owner and executive chef of Daily Dish Events and Catering in Franklin, showing us how to do it. Very good to be here. Yes, it's good to, good see, to you see you again. again. So, yeah, this is we have a cucumber round, and that Look is a that. goat cheese and wasabi mousse Ooh. with the ahi tuna on top and that's also some pretty. lemon zest. Very beautiful. So first, we have our hot pan. Doing it. And you want that pan really hot. I mean, really hot. You don't want to overcook it. But there's That's... no, you have no oil in. Are you going to put some oil in a little yeah, bit? Sure. Just Actually, little... you want to pour that some of that, that in there. What type um, of oil be careful. do you like? Uh, yeah, right. Now, yeah. What and so of... right here, that's a blend of olive oil and canola. Oh, okay. So nothing too special. You know, the canola brings the flash point up a little bit, so it doesn't smolder. Okay. Gotcha. Too bad. So it looks like we're hot. I yeah, think. it looks good. Let me see, I'm going to turn it up Rolling it around bit. there. Now, when you look for a, a good cut of tuna, like, how do you know? Well, here's the thing, you know, you, it's, it's all about the quality, and you have to, you have to look at it, and, and you, you see, you know, the color, and mm -hmm. so that's going to be um, what you're looking for. And also... Looking for that, like, vibrant, deep red purple. Yeah, yeah that, deep, okay. that deep red purple, so that, that's going to be your good stuff. And then also, when... When the fish starts getting old, it, it, it won't be as, you know, it'll spring back oh, when, when it's nice and fresh okay, like that. Okay. So, but we got it going on. When these, okay. when these are toasting, when these sesame seeds are toasting mm. to that golden brown, that's when you want to kind of turn it. I mean, this is fast. It, yeah, I was going to say, is there any this, dish that's faster to make than ahi tuna? This is a quickie, and this is right here. Let me see. We got it all, you know, nice and golden brown, but... You don't want to go too much okay. further than this, so we seared it. Nice. I'm going to shut Beautiful. this off Fastest so I don't smoke the place out. Ever had. Done. Yes, That's there we beautiful. go. Okay, so there we go. Some more magic with you. And okay. now here we have a little Cuisinart, and I have you know a little rubber spatula here, Good, but I like to play with we have some cream cheese. Yes. So, and then we also have some goat cheese. So let me get oh. some of that in there. And nice. then this is what kicks it up. I saw the wasabi tube. Is the wasabi. And I was like, hey, Carol, you want to put this in your mouth? <laughs> yes. No. Like, sure, give me a little bit of that. Give me, give me a hit. And I, I said, it's not, it. it's not wasabi, it's avocado. Yeah, sure. Look at it's that. It's not going to be bad. And so that, you just get a, you mix it up so most people have a Cuisinart. If not, you can mix it up by hand. Okay. But and then you did the pastry bags. That That's is so absolutely correct. So let's... Let me show you. I got a couple little okay. fun toys here, but this is a channel knife right here. And what we're going to do is we're going to strip it just like this. Okay. And oh, here I am. Oh, just person. give it like some little lines. I love yes. It. Okay. And so here I am making a mess, but I'll I put that it. over there. Bobby decoration. And then, real quick, I'm going to cut it. So we're going to go boom. And then we'll nice. get a few of them going on here. So, mm -hmm. and then this is a little melon ball scooper. So we're going to go ahead and go Oh, you're hollowing them out. Okay. Yeah, and this is what's going to hold the moose. Oh. And I actually, let me see here. I'm going to get I'm that. I love this. So we got that. This is cute. And I'm going to go ahead and move all this right here because okay. we're going to go ahead and pipe these out. Moose it. And we're going to moose it. Okay, with moose either one of these, good. are they both the same? Uh, one is for each you, so we're all going to get involved here. Oh. Oh, it's class participation. It Play with sure friends. is. So I'm there we go. I got that, that one. And there you go. There you go, Miss Kel. Right. All right, we're going to try this. I love a pastry bag. Oh. That's a good time. Look at that. Go ahead. pretty. Perfect. And then. <laughs> Open up. <laughs> yeah. Have some guacamole. I know. Is this hot? Is this really spicy? And mm. so here we go. I'm going to slice these up right here. Oh, no, that's Get a nice spicy. little knife here. And then they go right on top. So boom, oh, just like perfect. that. You want to get involved There's there? There's a little yes. hidden heat in there. It, it hits you at the end. It's not, it's excellent though. I really like it. Yeah, and you can even go further with that wasabi. You can get it to where it, you know, there's a right. nice burn on it. We're missing a piece. We're missing yeah, we another yeah, one there. What happened to that? I'm Very beautiful. Disappear. I don't know what happened. And then we have right here is a little 
if you want to go ahead and put a little dot on sure. each one. Yes. What is it? And this right here is a red pepper and hoisin glaze. Ooh, yeah. So we have a little red pepper jelly and hoisin. Very easy to make. The two ingredients. And hoisin is kind of like barbecue sauce, right? Like and it really is. Yeah. It's it, like it's a little bit of a Asian Asian barbecue so sauce. Pretty. Okay. That's and exactly you're putting a little bit of that. And this lemon. is lemon zest. So this is right here going to give oh, it a that. nice so the extra little touches. flavor. These are the never think of. that only he does. Who All wants right. to do that? You want to do that Daily a little bit? Daily Dish Events and Catering on Hillsboro Road. You can give them a call. They're in Franklin. Not Check out this. their menu, dailydishcatering.com. This is perfect for And our party. motto is, yes is the answer, what's the question? So I we develop it. menus all the time. Daily Dish, yes. check them out.